welcome back to my channel. Since we can't travel outside our city due to the recent outbreak and lockdowns, the kids have been studying online for the past three weeks. We decided to take a staycation. 10 minutes from our home, right in the middle of our city, Dongguan, we are going to check into the Intercontinental Hotel. The kids are super excited. The cats are at home, probably partying already. Our plan is to chill out, relax in the room, try out the gym, the go-karts, maybe take a walk at the nearby mall, enjoy the executive club, and mostly maybe try their dinner and breakfast buffet. So here we go. So the family is checking in right there. And it's really, really quiet here today. Again, because of the uh, recent outbreak lockdowns, I think it makes it kind of nice and quiet and even easier to check in. In other times of the year, this might be more full of people, of course. What do you think of the room? Good. Good? Uh -huh. What did you try already? Everything in the drawers. You, tr you, you checked the drawers? Uh -huh. What did you find? Flashlight. What else did you try? Did you try the uh, yes. The curtain? The, yeah, the, All the, the switches? Yes, the switches. No, don't, don't. We don't do that. Did you check the mini fridge? Yes. What's there? Things you can eat, but you have to pay. How is the view? What do you think? We got two, two rooms in the end, right? We yeah. got two rooms and you're staying with me? Yes. And mom is staying with Danny? Yes, but they will come back and like chill with us. Wh which bed do you want? Mm -hmm. Are you going to take a shower? Yes. Yes? Yes. You excited? Yes. So far, so good. So after we checked in two hours ago, and relaxed in our rooms a bit. Now we're here at the club lounge, the Intercontinental Club, right here, inside, enjoying some free refreshments. Alright, so we are sitting at the executive lounge they call the Club Intercontinental. On the second floor there is uh, coffee, tea, sodas, a lot of snacks and between 6 to 8 p.m. it's happy hour. You can also get alcoholic drinks for free. So everything here is free if you have the uh, rights to use it. I guess if you use the executive floors and also any regular room you can add some money I think around 200 RMB per day and you get the uh, perk of using this space and we are going for dinner all right like in every buffet restaurant first thing you do is take a good look around and scout what you want to try. A secret hack of uh, Five Star Hotel Buffet Restaurants. Ask for special dishes, ask what they got. Like I got a lobster and the prawns and anyone can get stuff. Depends what they have. If you don't find the food that you like, which I think is impossible, but uh, you can ask for other stuff. So we've been here almost two hours and um, I had my first, second, third, fourth, fifth, I haven't had dessert yet, but uh, I'm thinking about it. Let's see what the girls are singing.
Danny, what are you getting there? Dessert? Yeah. Ice cream? Blueberry and chocolate. You ready to go to sleep? Yes. All right, let's close the curtains. Good night. Good night, Zan. now I woke up at 6 15 I'm just checking up my email and made myself coffee it's really nice they have drip coffee and sweetener so um, and then I will go down to take a little walk and then off to breakfast so we went down to the fourth floor to the gym and it's uh, kind of close up but it's basically self-service. We prefer to get some fresh air and walk outside. So we're going down to the first floor. Elo, let's go out. We're going to take a walk around the block, maybe 10, 15 minutes. Kids are still sleeping in the rooms. And you can see right here, the Chi Feng Lantern, the famous Dongguan landmark. This right here is Dongguan's tallest building. I think it's 88 floors, something like that. Today is April 3rd and I just realized that the last time we traveled out of China was three years ago exactly. April 2019, we went to Israel to visit my family. It's not easy not to travel for three years regardless to where you live. Staycations are nice, but they can't replace visiting your family back home. This is how close the hotel is to the mall. That's the hotel building, and you can go, in, you can go into the mall right here. All right, it's uh, 8.33, we're going for breakfast. One Americano and one, one latte. Okay, okay, no problem. It's China, you gotta have congee but you also got to have the omelette station. Good coffee. So we just had the breakfast buffet. The eggs were good. I'm a sucker for eggs, omelette and poached eggs. They had the poached eggs with hollandaise sauce and parma ham. That was good. Bacon was not as crispy as I would want it to be. The pastries section is very good. Overall, very good. They can have more uh, cheese, in my opinion. Let's see how the go-karts ride go. And after that, we will do some dim sum for lunch and then we go home. All right, so now the kids are going to do go-karting. Now we are at the dim sum hall where they have yamcha from 9 a.m. and uh, dim sum going through lunch. Very local Wandong tradition. All right, so staycation is over. We are here at the first floor. We're going to check out of the hotel. It's been a good 24 hours with uh, a lot of relaxing and way too much food. So until the next time, if you're not subscribed to this channel yet, please consider to do so and share it with your friends. Give the video a like and I'll see you in the next video.